Listen to Steve Bunce on BBC London 94.9. It's Jane Couch now. She now she was the pioneer boxer, winning the right to become the first licensed female British boxer. She's now a promoter and manager, and she's also out there filming and meeting fighters. And her interview with Tyson Fury is memorable for one of her questions. You've got to YouTube it. I couldn't possibly mention it on air. And I reached for her earlier, and I asked Queen Jane of Blackpool what fight she would like to see most during the next 12 months. Amir Khan, Kelbrook, definitely. And do you think that will happen, Jane? Do you know what? I think it might. I th- now, now Kel's um, getting out there a bit more. Um, I think it might just happen. Now, what about you, Jane? You're at all sorts of shows. I mean, I go to enough shows, but you go about three times as many as me. <laughs> what about down the card, away from the Kel Brooks and the Amir cards? What, what fight down there, the fights that go under the radar, would you like to see? Yeah, what about Curtis Woodhouse can't play? Oh, that's not bad, yeah. The old Wood- I tell you what, Wood- what about a Woodhouse-Gavin rematch? So, he- yeah. so Woodhouse can make some proper money. Yeah, that's a good one. What about Billy Joe Saunders versus Martin Murray? Yeah, Billy Joe Saunders, Martin Murray. People have been talking about that one. And the other one they've been talking about is uh, Billy Joe Saunders, Paul Smith. That's a good fight. But what about Go on. Junior Witter versus Matthew Atten? No, I'm loving it. Keep going. Keep going, Jane. <laughs> What about Carl Froch, George Groves? Oh, you know what? Carl Froch, George Groves down the line, that's a possibility. What about George Groves, Kenny Anderson, long overdue rematch? That is a very good fight. I'll um, give you that one. What about Edwards on. Edwards rematch? That's not bad. I'm loving Edwards Edwards rematch. That's really easy for the commentator. Be no good if it was in black and white. <laughs> <laughs> what about Go on. Max Maxwell, yep. Brian Rawls, and he's already beaten by Brian Rawls? And, 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 and that's quite good, that one, because it's like, in theory... That's two guys that have got to turn it round. That's good. I'm loving that, Jane. Keep going. Uh, Give me one me more. Think. Kevin Mitchell, Rios, definitely. Yeah, Ke- yeah Ke- Mitchell, I think, and Rios is a possibility. What about John Murray after that fight? What would you, if you were, you know, you're managing, you promote fighters, Jane. Uh, obviously, in addition to Jane Couch, uh, JaneCouchBoxing.com. But what would you do with John Mitchell? How? Sorry, we, we, sorry, with John Murray. How would you bring John back? John Murray, he's a good fighter, you know. Yeah, maybe. He could go up to light welterweight because he's quite big at lightweight, isn't he? Yeah. If he yeah. went up to light welterweight, um, maybe he could box him on like place or somebody like that. I don't know. Do you, do you feel for fighters like Ashley Fierthay, you know, British champion, you yeah. know, doesn't get a mention. No one's talking about him on the world stage. No one's talking about him really, in, you know, getting him in good fights. Do you feel for fighters like that that are on the outside, Jane? Yeah, I did a good interview with Ashley Fierthay on my website. But what about Fierthay and McCloskey? That'd be a good one. Oh, now you're talking my language. I tell you what, Jane Couch, it's always a pleasure. Jane, you're in a cafe at the moment. Yeah, I'm in, uh, I'm in Starbucks somewhere on the motorway. I've just been interviewing some boxers in Trowbridge. OK, Joy, tell you get around, girl, don't you? Motorway, <laughs> Trowbridge, you get around. I'm going to Wales tomorrow, then I'm going to Ireland next week. Oh, listen, Jane, it's a pleasure. Once again, it's janecouchboxing.com. Jane, thanks for your time. Thank you, Stevie. Keep it up, babe. Jane Couch, and that's uh, janecouchboxing.com if you want to listen to that.